Another very exciting thing is that I booked actually a capsule hotel in Kyrgyzstan, in Osh. I've been in the capsule hotel before I was in Ukraine, in Kiev. But this is gonna be my first and very interesting experience in the Central Asia to sleep in a capsule hotel. I think I just arrived. This is the hotel, capsule hotel. Let's check it out and see how the capsule hotel experience is in Kyrgyzstan. I'm very curious how, it, how different it will be from Ukraine. Assalamu alaikum. I do YouTube video, it's okay? Davud. Assalamu alaikum. <laughs> this is the reception area of my capsule hotel. Look at this, the furniture and everything. There's a small kitchen and the fridge, beautiful table. And this takes us to the rooms. Keep calm and keep quiet. <laughs> At the super. Amazing. So, I have a capsule? More capsule? Good day. Le boy. So, I have the privilege to choose whatever capsule I want to sleep in. Look at this. These are very small capsules from the wood. Можно is this? 25 или или 24? 24. Yeah, okay. Okay, perfect. So guys, I will put my bag down, do the paperwork for passport and everything, then later I will show you how it feels like to be in the capsule in Kyrgyzstan. So we're gonna have a small tour to show the toilets and the bath as well. So this is the small area to wash your hands and this is the bath. Amazing. Everything looks super fresh and modern as well. And this is the toilet area. Amazing. And there's a place to iron your things, hang your stuff, and washing machine. Mm, yeah, super! Yeah. <laughs> Amazing. A potom kuchne jest? Kuchne tam reception. Ah, there are more. <laughs> more skoy. Ah, okay, so this is the man toilet, which seems exactly the same. I don't think it really matters which gender is it. But great to separate. <clears throat> Capsule wash. Interesting. But very different from the Ukraine capsule hotel I've been to. Keep calm, keep clean. <laughs> Super. I thought. The refrigerator. Pusto. 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 <laughs> uh, no tourists, no food. It's uh. empty refrigerator. But everything seems like will be for me. Amazing. So I will see you in the room itself, guys. Okay, before I show you the room, maybe you are wondering about the pricing. So I paid $19 for two nights in this capsule hotel and eight dollars basically which is around six euro and sixty cents very good price i think for kyrgyzstan and the facilities looks amazing very fresh everything new uh, i don't know how what does it mean to sleep in this small capsules not sure if there is a air circulation i see there is a small table to put your laptop and work I will check out also the, if there is a light and these things. Then I will rate the place if it's worth it for nine dollars. So this time for sure. See you in the room. 
So, as I have promised, we are gonna do the tour of the room, capsule room. So I have my capsule, which is the number 24 here. And this is actually the first time I'm getting in to the capsule room and I want to share the whole experience with you without cuts, without edits, poor emotions and the royal experience. So once you get in, you can easily sit. There's a, enough space here. There's a password for the Wi-Fi. You don't supposed to eat or smoke. Obviously it's a wood. You don't want to make a fire here. Uh, there's a ventilation system and this is the lights and there's only one light which is here but I'm not sure how the ventilation systems work that's something I need to check and uh, and as a very important thing which I didn't have in the Kiev capsule uh, is this laptop holder so what you do is basically you can just open it and I think you need to stick this here okay perfect so basically you can put your laptop you can work here maybe put some drink but yeah not sure if it's too comfortable because it's a little bit far away if it was somewhere here to put your laptop and lean back to the wall that would be perfect but still it's there to put your phone or anything basically there's a magnet it gets stuck and there's a socket here actually many of them there's a two of them here and then when you lay down just above your head there's a two more so when you lay down Oh, this is the this is comfortable actually and when I'm laying down there is actually enough space for my foot and I'm 180 centimeters so if I can fit here I think any average person can do and then when you get in you can close this sliding door you have it's again wood wooden door I have my phone here you close it and there is also kind of lock here which you can lock the door if you don't want to let someone in you can just talk to them <laughs> from here and then yeah don't let them in this is the kind of lock it has the one i was staying in kiev it had automatic there was a buttons here you could change the colors of the light you could lock your door and also unlock your door with the button but it's fine i mean it's not uh, it's not too modern but uh, for the eight dollars in kyrgyzstan and it's this is the actually first capsule hotel or hostel in whole kyrgyzstan and maybe it's actually in the Central Asia, I don't know. But definitely it's the first one in whole Kyrgyzstan. So for the experience and for the idea, you know, you can fit many people here. And also you have your own personal space. You can lock your door if you don't want to talk to someone. Yeah, pretty cool. I actually like the idea and I will sleep there tonight and I will test it out. And for your information, there's also lockers just under the bed in case you want to put something there. There's also mine here, which is full. So quite enough space. And there's a washing machine, as I showed you before. And also there's a extra locker in your service. And the facilities are super clean. I took a shower, long one, and a hot one actually, so the water comes well, it's super clean and super comfortable as well. Great, I think this is the end of the tour from the capsule 
hotel from Kyrgyzstan. This is my first night here and uh, I will be taking rest and tomorrow I will be exploring Kyrgyzstan. So thank you so much guys for watching and I will see you in another video, this time not from Uzbekistan, from Kyrgyzstan.